Hey, everybody, we are here. We are live. I asked that my Facebook friends stop messaging me. Um, we're at the store. It's Sunday, and we have a few featured items. Now, if you want to, and I'm going to finish this live. I didn't do that this time, but I'm going to go back and edit the title with the link to the Mineral Mosaic Facebook page. And you can order any of the crystals that you're about to see in this video online directly through him. So I'm going to turn the camera around. Say hi, Eric. <laughs> you want to be on the video? And then give me your name. Yeah, Say hi. Yeah, so Taja brought some diapers for Danny. I don't know if you guys were here yesterday in the store when my friend Danny came in with a new baby, number six. She did not know she was pregnant until 24 weeks old. She brought some diapers and some nursing pads, and that was really awesome. And I'm going to take them after the store. So if you guys have any newborn girl stuff, you can send it here to the store, and I will uh, take it over to Danny or any girl stuff, uh, gently used, unused. Just let me know. So anyways, we're going to get back to Eric. Eric, tell us what the featured items are today. All right. I pulled out some cool stuff here. Um, to begin with, Moldavite's real popular. I got a bunch of new stuff in, and just so y'all know, this is going to be increasingly difficult to get. The supply is almost gone, and it's now an 800 and something euro fine for collecting it illegally in, in uh, oh, good grief. Right. over there where they find it. And so, Moldavite, uh, very popular stone. So this what, stone right here. Uh, how much would that run? I think I, I, this one is uh, $54. Wow, that's a small stone. Now tell me about Moldavite. What does it do? And I've heard about it a lot from my Mambo and other practitioners, but tell us a little bit about Moldavite. Well, because its origins, or at least its partial origins, are outer space and from a meteorite impact, it brings a lot of alien energy and yes. some people feel that it's got a really strong fast high vibration and it's real intense some yes. people it's too intense for they don't like it other yes. people love it but it's known for uh removing blockages in the heart chakra and helping with psychic abilities and so what about these chips here what would how much would those go i didn't for? actually weigh them but they're all fairly small and they're still really nice pieces and they weigh, they go for if it's a buy grand price, I'm guessing that piece would be somewhere in the range of like seven or eight dollars. Right. So you know, so you can get a little bit you of this. You can get love. a small one for a couple bucks right, or a right, dollar right, even. Right, right. So you know, contact the Mineral Mosaic Facebook page. I will be putting it in the description after the video processes. I apologize. Yesterday I had it up, but you will be able to see the link right there um, once we finish the video. So what is this very interesting stone so here? So this is another tectite. Real similar to Moldavite. Now these stones, I collect them myself. This is the only stone that I collect myself. It's a tectite that's found in Arizona. And mm -hmm. it's interesting because it looks so like lava rock, black right, to opaque, right, right, but right. you put, put a light behind it and you'll <gasps> find it's translucent. Oh my God, that is so freaking and, cool. And so. Oh my God. And, and it's, it's glass, it's, it's, it's space, or, you know, it's a uh, meteorite glass, impact wow. glass. Wow, so look at that. This stone is connected with the star system Sirius. It's oh, believed wow. that it's uh, burying it around the world is creating an activation grid to sort of help humanity move into the next phase of our wow. existence. So you could bury some of that in your garden. That's right. It's good to bury them in the yard. It's also like Moldavite's very intense. Some people, it's a little too much to keep it on them. But some people like myself who are very high, you know, energy, we, right. we, we seem to go that. well with right, it. Right, right, right. Right. And that piece, the large piece there, is worth $85. Wow. The small, the small one is worth is... about 5 And I've got lots more of the smalls. I'm just going to get a small $5 one yeah. and put it with some green moss agate in my garden. Very great year. thing. Yeah, they, they love to be buried in, especially if you buried in a spot where you can never pull it up and look at it Exactly. Again. <laughs> nice right. to know where they are. Yes, and then that's my raised bed vegetable garden because we have high radon content uh -huh. here in Ohio, so I decided to do raised bed. The soil here is amazing. I don't know if it's because of the radon. Hmm. Everything grows, but the it's very difficult for the raised bed garden, but at least the stuff that we're going to eat, I keep in a raised bed garden That's rather good. than keep put that in the way down ground. Yeah. Yes. And so what is this green piece? So here? That That's is amazing. called tremolite. That's another really beautiful stone. Fairly Look rare. Look at that, y'all. And it, uh, let's see, metaphysical, metaphysical properties, it helps to for people to develop better contact and better relationships with others. That's lovely. And 
um, helps alleviate depression and helps with partner bonding. So that would be awesome, and with uh, would compared with some lapidolite, that would and then some rhodonite. That's some that's some real healing going on right there. Right, it's a beautiful stone. It's a, it's also rare and expensive, forty dollar piece right there. Yeah, and you can see according I have to his smaller fingers, sizes. Yes, yes. Yeah, if you if I pick it up, it's fairly large it's for so a piece. Excellent. I would yeah. I would hold that in my hands while meditating. Maybe even put it in my singing bowl if it wouldn't alter the its ability to that play. That would be a good idea. Yeah. So that would you know bring all those vibrations together so I like that mm -hmm. and this here that's Larimar and that uh, helps with pretty much all of the upper chakras and it's a healing stone brings tranquility and peace it's this light blue is very very celestial color very very kind of beautiful. heavenly that is and really beautiful. very nice stone a lot of people use it in gemstone first for jewelry and things mm -hmm. now sujalite is another rare stone oh my god look at that and this that is, is a nice so piece it's 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 exceedingly hard to get these days. I think they mined it out a long time ago. Oh. And this one metaphysically helps release worries and stress, and it also helps with forgiveness. That's nice, and you could just use that as a worry stone sitting mm -hmm. there holding it's, your It's hands. partially tumbled, so it's smooth. Yes, it's nice to it put feels, it on your it hand. It looks cool. And I, I've got it. it. The sticker price is 94 I could sell it for 90 It's very hard to get this again, so I'm reluctant to even sell these bigger pieces I have. Yeah. But if someone really needs this piece... Then hit me up. And with all crystals, you know, we love crystals, but you do want to get what you need rather than just hoarding crystals right. for crystals' sake. You want the, to have them. Um, and, you know, when I first started collecting crystals, I really didn't think about that. But now more and more I really do. You want to make sure that the stuff is ethically harvested and mm -hmm. you want to make sure it's ecologically not being oversourced. But some of these stones really people need in their lives. So if, if something like this, something incredibly rare, something, make sure that it appeals to your spiritual needs when purchasing, okay? Usually when a stone really calls to you, that's saying something. Right. If it's just like, oh, I like that, I want it. It's different from right. that feeling you get when you know that there's a reason to get something, right. even just, if you don't understand like, it. Like, night the colors the patterns they just sit with my soul mm -hmm. it was, it's just it, so funny the colors remind me of vintage barbies for some reason mm. and i know with barbies i would do a lot of role play and acting out yeah. of different things in my life including good things and trauma so it's like for me i look at it from that perspective mm -hmm. and that's why i understand why i am so drawn yeah. to that and so then what we have so here, this is vanadenite this is a spectacular piece it's you, can, you can see these cool little crystals. That's the vanadinite growing there on this matrix. And vanadinite is good for endurance and persistence and willpower. Wow. So this is all really relevant stuff. If we're going through hard times in the world, yes. we all need persistence and willpower. So is that mounted on, like, petrified wood? No, no. That's, what is it? I don't actually know what the matrix is. It's got some crystal in it. Um, wow, and that's probably that solomelane, the black, which is... An interesting mineral in and of itself, even though it's just, you know, not very recognizable. But the vanadinite pieces are little hexagonal, cube, almost some of them are cubic, some of them are hexagonal, and they just look like little little confetti chips that are really yes. sparkly and pretty. They're very nice, very beautiful stone. That is and beautiful. that one's only $40. Really? Yeah, wow. which is a great See? price for that. I mean, that's a steal on that I don't piece. even, man, oh, you, you're just killing me. I got a box sitting at my desk. Now, let me show you all the size of my hand. Now, this is a wand in and of itself. Now, you all know we sell the smaller amethyst points. I know Mark better not see this because he will put this shit on the end of a wand. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is an amethyst point, and this is the size of my hand, y'all. Here, let me turn this around. This is the size of my head. Okay, this is $128. This is a beautiful amethyst point, and if you want it, Get a hold of Mineral Mosaic. Like I said, the link will be in the uh, video description in the title. But I just love this. I just love this one. But I'm trying not to hoard. So, anyways, do you, you got some other stuff here that you want to show us? Yeah, that, okay. just a few more here. Okay. This is a, a black tourmaline polish piece. Wow. Which is fairly large. It's got some interesting, uh, you know... That is beautiful. That interesting is patterns on there. Got a whole beautiful. bunch of these in different sizes. Okay. And this is just a piece that I thought was fairly nice looking. Uh, but I'd really like to talk about this one. This is called Tanzarine. Uh huh. Uh, it is a quartzite that is newly discovered from wow. Tanzania, and it is fairly rare. There's not very much of it out there in the market. Uh huh. And 
what we know of it so far is that it's uh, metaphysically used for patience and healing. Ooh. And it's helpful for the heart and for just emotional And how issues. much would a piece like that go for? So this piece right here is $30, and this bigger one, they weigh almost exactly double each other. That one's 60 Okay, awesome. And this here, this I have some of this tumbled. Mahogany I, obsidian. Yes, I have this at home, but not like this. Yeah, these are nice, big, large pieces. They're somewhat tumbled, so they don't cut your hand. They but are beautiful. They're, they're still more or less just broken as they as they were. And just they're, polished a little bit. Yeah, they, we just we just took off the edges a little, and they're not expensive at all. Like I can sell each of these pieces, even though they're real big. They're about eight dollars each. So yeah, I'll be grabbing one of those. So yeah, that's pretty yeah. much all that I had highlighted over here. Yeah. So we have, like I said, we the, the tables are just endless here with very interesting finds. I mean, everything that Eric does, he does uniquely, and that's one of the reasons why I keep having him come back because you know when he pulled up with this beekeeper truck and it was like I went out to go and uh see some of these crystals I was telling my daughter if I don't come back it's like the guy who says I've got candy in the van you know because I was just like out there but this is this is beautiful what is this one here dioptase dioptase yeah what is dioptase so dioptase is also very rare especially a piece that large uh-huh it's it's something that you often find in little tiny, you know, crystalline the faces on stuff. Um, but it's loving energy. Uh, it's it's, so it can cultivate kindness and compassion. Look at that. And good for relationships, helpful with relationships. See, that is just beautiful. I would put that on my ancestor altar. I have petrified wood on my ancestor altar because it was one of my grandmother's favorite stones. But it's so lightweight and it's so beautiful. Yeah, We've got some more yeah. This is, these these are both specimen pieces. They're both Look at over two hundred dollars. Or this one's a little under. This yes. one's closer to three. I have some small pieces of it too. Okay, all right. But I, you know, on display, I have these nice ones. Oh, my God, that's amazing. Seraphonite is also a really pretty stone. I love this. It's This one's got a little bit more girth to it. I love how it's just got that natural shine on the inside. It, it Man, I wish I could get countertops of this. I know. Wouldn't that be great? Yes. Do you have the properties of this? Yeah, yeah. Stone? Uh, spiritual enlightenment and wow. uh, communication with higher energies. That is, oh, that's another and, great piece for your altar. Yeah, good for self-healing. If you're trying to do your own self-healing, that's a yes. good, a and good so, aid in that. And, and in how much would that be? Um, a piece like that. So this piece is marked at 167, but I could make a deal on it if someone yes. really wants it. So you guys ordering today, um, and I'm going, like I said, I'm going to put the link um, in here um, when the video processes. You're going to order these directly through Mineral Mosaic. I do have a box of goodies that I have picked out for the store. Oh, I have never seen orange kyanite. Oh my right. God. Yeah, that's, a, that's another rare one. Um, it's, Four dollars a gram. That's yeah, beautiful. It's not easy to get, so I, I have a fairly yes, highly priced. That's beautiful. It's a good, uh, good grounding stone. Helps balance the yin and yang energies. Awesome. Great awesome. for artists and musicians. Awesome. Wouldn't it be nice if you could actually get a piece strong enough to make a guitar pick from? Oh, that's that would, a great idea. That would be incredible. Oh, right. So here's some of the seraphite yeah, more, smaller more seraphim, and, and yeah. smaller pieces. So that big stone that I just showed you, we got some smaller pieces here for some good prices. That one's going for 20 yeah. and the other one's going for 24 d d These are beautiful pieces, y'all. So... If you are in the Reynoldsburg, Ohio area, we're going to go ahead and close things down at 3 o'clock. He's got a couple other opportunities here in the area, and he wants to get home to his family. Um, things were really busy yesterday, but because we're not typically open on Sundays and because of the Rona, um, we may be a little slow today. And so, you know, I know I'm going home, probably take a nap, spend some time with my family, take care of things at the house. Um, we have no intentions at this time to close the store. However, if we do, it will not be a closure of the business. It would just be a closure of the store and you can still order via the website. Um, you know, we've got kids and, you know, um, we, you know, we have to see how this is going. Try not to panic, but definitely trying to use our good sense. So, but at this time, we're, we're not making a decision to close our store. Um, we don't sell food, people, you know, but this disease is airborne. So you guys be careful out there. Don't panic. 
just take care of yourselves and wash your goddamned hands, okay? Love, peace, and Afro grease. Oh, also, elderberry tea. If you guys are ordering elderberry from the website, know that we don't have a lot left. We would ask that you would limit your purchase to one ounce per person. If somebody orders like a shit ton, I'm going to cancel your order, and, or at least that part of your order. We're only going to send one ounce per person. There's a ton of healing herbs that we have here. People are coming in. They're getting them. I have my reserves. I've got my special tea made. Um, you know, it's an immunity. It's a tea I use every time I get the flu. Um, if this persists, maybe I'll make some to sell. But you guys um, work on your drink, your apple cider vinegar. Uh, take your echinacea, your spirulina, all different types of things like that that are good for you. Um, ingest those things, okay, um, that you know that you can do. That you know, Make sure that you don't have any particular drug interactions with herbs because that's where all pharmaceuticals come from. Um, and then, you know, just take care of yourselves and wash your damn hands, okay? God bless. Uh, God is blessed. Love, peace, and Afro-Grease. Stay black, y'all. Bye.